Crunch in their military jerseys. Black jerseys with the dark camo, white numbers. They go from left to right. The Monsters in their road whites tonight. Black pants, white helmets from right to left. The puck is dropped, and we're underway in Syracuse. Crunch control, have the puck left wing, Toby B. Saad. Taken back at center by Trey Fix, Wolanski. Throws it ahead, he's got Del Bell Blues behind the defense, and on net, a backhand and a save made by Tompkins. Big early chance for Luca Del Bell Blues, and Matt Tompkins swallows up a backhand opportunity. A right wing pass comes to Rocco Grimaldi. Veteran forward down low, throws it in front, they score. It ricocheted off of Santini and in. A power play goal by Rocco Grimaldi, and the Monsters, eight seconds into their opening power play, take a 1 nothing lead, 13 43 left in the first period. So Grimaldi gets the power play goal, and the Monsters open the scoring, his second goal of the year. Holds on on this Cleveland power play. Down low for McCown, centers, it's blocked. Back to Del Bell, lose a save, a rebound, and tight, and it's kept out by the crunch, and now they score with 1.2 seconds to go. Luca Del Bell, Belouz makes it two nothing. Monsters with a power play goal. Also, oh, Nip Mouse scramble. Tompkins made a diving, lunging save. There were a couple of defenders in the vicinity. The crunch could not quite keep it out to end the period. So Cleveland strikes again, a second first period power play goal, and it's 2-0. Left wing pass, now comes across, hurts Golanski, in, shoots, scores! Trey Fix, Golanski makes it 3-0 Monsters. 13-25 to go in this second period. Well, the usual suspects for Cleveland now getting involved. Trey Fix, Golanski, dominant scorer for the Monsters, snaps it past the right arm of Tompkins, and it's 3-0 Monsters. 13-25 left in the second period. As Fortier sets up Duke in the offensive zone, tries to thread the needle for Hooten, and ends up in behind the net. And now the gloves are gonna drop, it's Crozier. Crozier's dropped it with McHugh. They come together, Crozier throwing a heavy right, McHugh comes back, Crozier landing some heavy rights again. McHugh got it right over the, uh, the helmet, then a midsection blow. Crozier back with some rights across the side of the face, a wild right by McHugh. Crozier lands another one. Oh, he's hammered away now. And the officials will even step in. Well, that has ignited this uh, building tonight. Max Crozier and Max McHugh. Back across to the near boards for Gonsalves to the crunch. Turns back toward his own zone. His pass picked off. Short-handed, here's Pearson. He's in, shoots, scores. A shorthanded goal for Justin Pearson, and it's 4-0 Monsters. With 4.38 to go in the second period, Cleveland cashes in shorthanded, the third shorthanded goal allowed this year for the crunch. And that's just a disaster. Gonsalves reaches it for the crunch, comes to Sherry, shoots and scores! Connor Sherry hammers one hole, but early strike in the third for the crunch. 129 into the third, it's a 4-1 game. Gonsalves pokes it past him, he's got Shiri across. Steady drops it for Fortier to the net, he scores! 10.39 to go in the third game, Fortier has cut the deficit to two. He drove hard to the net and stuffs it past Greaves. It's 4-2 here in the third. Big time power move by Gabe Fortier. He went crashing into Greaves, but forced it home before the collision. And the Crunch have scored twice in the period, and they're right back within two, not even halfway through this third. It's poked out of the zone. Sillinger tracks it down, near his side, gets down low, pass in front, they score. It was tapped home by Grimaldi into the empty net. With 2.41 to go in the third period, his second goal of this, uh, this evening. Rocco Grimaldi makes it 5-2 Monsters here in the third.